Canvas Student App is an essential feature of Canvas that enhances your experience in accessing the platform. This is available for download for both Android and iOS and is all also free. This can, we also have different applications for both instructors and the parents that are accessible via the Play Stores. And the Student App is something that we really encourage everyone to be using in today's um, education. So to start off, this is how the student app looks like. And as you can see, you will see all your courses on this main screen already. At the bottom page, you will see different tabs here that you can access. And these tabs are very essential. So the first one, we have the calendar. The calendar is going to be exported from Canvas. And this is where you can access all your upcoming deadlines or due dates for your courses. So as you can see on my calendar, um, you will see that there is a notification here or information here with regards to one of my assignments that is due on the 24th. And if I click on it, I will be able to access the actual assignment. Next, we have the to-do list. These are your actionable items that you uh, that are upcoming with their due dates. And you will be able to access them by simply clicking on the assignment and it will redirect you to the um, task itself. You also have notifications which will notify you for any upcoming quizzes or assignments and as well as any updates or announcements from your teacher. And finally, you will have your inbox wherein all messages from your instructors will be sent to you. One of the core features of Canvas Mobile is the fact that you can actually download your content offline. What this means is that you will be able to sync your content while you have internet connection. So here you can see I selected the courses that I want to sync. Okay, So I just have to select the content that I want to sync. Then I can simply click the sync button, which will allow me to access these um, modules or these content offline. So when I go on a commute and I don't have internet connection, I'll still be able to access my course content. However, there are some limitations to this. Um, for the Canvas Mobile, when you sync your content, you will be only able to access the content that do not require any interaction. So that being said, that would be your pages, um, would also be your course content. But when it comes to discussion or quizzes, you will have to do this online. Now, let's get into Canvas Mobile. So this is how Canvas Mobile looks like. So when you enter your course, as you can see, it will try and format everything according to how you see it on your computer as well. If I go into modules, which will, I'm assuming most of you will be spending most of your time, you will still see the different modules you have access to as well as the ones that are locked. Now again, if your content is synced offline, you will be able to access these content. So for example, this welcome page will be accessible. However, this knowledge check or this quiz may not be. Okay, So this will require an external tool. That means that you won't be able to access this. Now with Canvas Mobile, you'll be able to do everything that you do on PC as well. However, there are some limitations to this. Some applications do not run on the Canvas Mobile, especially if your teacher or your instructor chooses to use an external application. However, if the content was built on Canvas, you will be able to access this content on the mobile application. So any videos that you may have, um, any discussion boards, any content, any quizzes will be highly accessible. And with that, that is the Canvas Mobile, and I hope you learned a thing or two with this short video.